Hello everyone! These days, other than my usual job, I dedicated a lot of time in relocating. I have also lost some time in playing video games. However, it is about time to start with the first interview of the channel. Even if the name of the channel is Strange Tales of Laowai, I will start with a Chinese girl. She is a good friend of mine, and thanks to her help, I found my actual job in Shanghai. By the way, she owns an apartment on Airbnb. So if you're planning to visit Shanghai, this could be a good choice. Now you can open. <laughs> it's cold. Link in description. What is your name? Chinese name, Yongzhen. You have a name that is not Chinese? Indian name, Shandi. Where you come from? It's the most middle provinces in China. Henan. Which city? Bingbingshan. Because you told me Zhengzhou. You only know Zhengzhou, sorry. In the north of Bingbingshan. What do you want to tell about yourself? Ah. Uh, Why are you going to Shanghai? Mm -hmm. It's the most international city in China. So you like to meet the... Different culture. This is the most important reason why I came here. So you like to travel? Yeah, actually I... I hope I can stay two months in every country. To better understand the place. Different culture, different regions. Actually it can show my soul. I think that it's interesting. You see in China, Mostly, we don't have religions, we don't believe God, we don't believe Buddha, or even we don't believe any religions. So, when I travel to other countries, uh, meet some strange people, in the beginning I can understand them. Because we have different culture, yeah, we have different background, staying there, living there for some time. Yeah, I can understand the culture, I can understand, yeah, why they behave like this? <laughs> <laughs> why they believe like this is the most important because thing. It's very interesting why travel in Malaysia in front of an Indian temple, you know. I saw a Indian guy, he ride a motorbike in front of the Indian temple. He just stopped and sit in his motorbike and do this and close his eye two seconds and then he read his motorbike to leave there he came there I guess he came there following a red motorbike just for to do just for to do this position to do this and then two seconds or three seconds and then he did so I think we um, for Chinese you know um, we will think it's funny about yeah, but because I lived in India two months, I can understand why they do this. I think that, yeah, they, even they are not so rich, but they has, has some power inside them. So I think they live happy. 
using the, the Chinese worst behavior restaurant, will you just arrive to China? Actually, no, because I already have uh, an idea. People of Far East uh, have a different way of behaving. What do you do in Shanghai? Now? Yeah? I help others find a job. You mean for uh, Yujia? It's not Yujia, it's Yuga. I don't want to become a normal yoga teacher. Because I practice yoga a long time. I know yoga first time when I'm 17 years old. So, in that time, I think, yeah, I'm a dancer. Um, and I, I think about my life when I'm 13, when I'm 17 years old. I, in that age, I thought of my life. Yeah, maybe if I cannot dance, dancing, maybe I can become a yoga teacher. In that time, I think about serious about this question. But uh, no, I told myself I don't want to become a normal yoga teacher. I want to do something interesting, more interesting. Something can influence more people. Um, so till now, before I think it's so easy, you know, because I can practice yoga well. So it's not so difficult for me to teach others. Now I think even you want to become good yoga teacher, great yoga teacher is not so easy. Yeah, I have so many yoga teachers, but they are different level. If you want to become a great yoga teacher, even you, even if, if someone said, oh, I'm the best yoga teacher in Shanghai, I think it's a good, great success for me. I just want to become flexible yoga teacher. Flexible teacher. I think you can say that hey, if it's one part of yoga, or you can say that yoga is one part of the flexible. Both. I also want to teach you know, guy how to become more flexible. What do you think uh, makes uh, your life uh, decent? Uh, and you and you think yeah, I'm happy. I am alive because there is this thing. So first level things can make me happy is, for example, I make a little money. So only the first level, I am a rich. I make some money and uh, here is a nice dancing, uh, African music for dancing. Yeah, it really like me, oh my god. It's, I can forget the something that I'm not so happy. But only short time. And when I heard when I hear the African music now, yeah, it will very like me relax and happy. I think the second level something can make me happy is uh, yeah, I have really good relationship. Not only superficial relationship, yeah, with people I have really good relationship. And maybe I can find a nice guy. Yeah, we have really good connect with each other. I have a very good relationship with my with friends. And the most high level, the third level for me can make me really, really happy is that I can do something that can influence a lot of people. I hope someday I can sit here, maybe sound out people stay. Here, they can hear they can hear what I'm talking about and they can they, and they really think uh, what I'm talking about is right uh, maybe I can become a great writer can write some work can really influence many people not only several people after I die yes yeah, someone will watch the movie or maybe read uh, one word on the wall or this comes from Yunzhen. Yunzhen. Yeah, even I die, yeah, my spirit is still on the wall. So this is the, the real thing that makes me happy in a very deep, in a very high level. I'm sorry, my parents, my brothers, I don't want to connect with them so much because I'm so different with the 
they think that yeah, I should do something. I should get married. I should, uh, you know, stay one place and uh, have a go in a good company, just work. Yeah, all the time. Yeah, they should. I think I should think about my future. But for me, I like I like to do something follow my path. Yeah, today I want to do this. I just do it. But tomorrow maybe I change my mind. I just follow my heart. This is why my family think, yeah, I'm even I'm almost thirty years old, but I'm still like children. Many parents they always they yeah. see you as, as a child. And if you're thirty years old, you don't have a, you don't have get married. Do you worry about it? Yeah, no, you are young. You can live yourself. So how? What about after 10 years, 20 years, if you're still alone, how you can live? always worry about these questions. You will get a cat. Yeah, even I, I myself, I cannot feed myself well. I cannot, you know, have a so good life. Sometimes I need to worry about one, yeah, money. Sometimes I just, I want to move to another city. I want to change one style of my life maybe i go to a temple and i cut all my hair and I never get married who knows another life another kinds of life i don't want to i just uh, save life all my life sometimes i go to the you know the fire stuff mm -hmm. maybe i mean sometimes i go to another world not here Fantasy. Yeah, but I think the most important we should follow the follow the society. If I really have a good person can get married, yeah, I will do it. I just don't want to rush. I just don't want oh I should get married. I I need to get married and then I can have another life. It's not right. If you cannot live happy yourself, you cannot meet the right person. Yeah, then you can get really happy. If you're not so happy, you just hope, oh, maybe I can meet another person, then I will be happy. It's not true. Who is the most important person in your life right now? Oh. Or many people, not only one. Can I say it's myself? Good answer. Yeah. <laughs> What is the next country you would like to visit? Mm, it's Europe. Europe. Country. Okay. Italy or German or Swedish. My friend, she lived there and she told me the North European guy is the best guy in the world. I'm not sure because I've never been there. And why she said like this? Because he seems the European guy, you match someone in the tender, but they were gentle. Mostly they talk about with you in the coffee shop. Most the topic is about how about the world, how about the life, how about you know. It's a great topic, not only, okay, come to, you want to come to my home? You want, yeah, you want <clears throat> go to the bar like this. So she thinks the North European guy is more about care about the spirit, not only the shape of the body. This is my friend told me. But for me, I've never been there. For me, I think uh, if, if I have, a, if I get married with a North European guy, maybe it's not bad to trust. Because there, even I heard you know your work. Yeah, the government will give you a good life. <laughs> they will give you like a, here. It is for you. Please take no, it. No, no. Just because you know, uh, there are children. If you give birth to children, the government will give okay. you some money to feed the children. If you go to the school, it's free to accept the education. So you want to have children to have money? No, just one. One reason, but it's not all the reason. Mm, 
For me, this is one reason, and um, I think the Italian guy is not bad. They are nice, uh, look good looking, and also the Italian food is good. A lot of many, I think I have many, I don't know how to speak, many statues on the big buildings, on the buildings in Italy. They are people's statue, the person's statue on the big buildings in Italy. The Colosseum. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I think this one is a little similar with the Indian temple, you know. Because in many Indian temples, even you stand outside of the temple, you will see all so many people sit on the temple, on the top of the temple. Are you mean church? Yeah, 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 yeah with yeah. possible. Yeah. Yeah, 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 because in Italy, you have yourself the religion. Um, I think every nation has their self religion, not only God, not only, you know, yeah, they have their self culture or religion. You know, I am a spiritual person, but I do not follow a particular religion. Mm -hmm. Most of the Italian, they consider themselves Catholic. And most of them follow maybe some or many of uh, the rules of the religion, but very few follow all the rules of the religion. And uh, I want to go to learn the opera. No. I studied opera. Really? Um, yeah. This Which one? Opera. Yeah, but Chinese opera. A ah, Chinese. No. So why stay in their two months? Um, they have a talent show, you know. I give some Chinese opera and Chinese traditional dancing but to, to, to my woman. classmate. To your classmate, okay. Yeah, so they think, oh my god, amazing. It is so beautiful, so nice. And but actually more than ten years I never seen a dancing one oh. little girl. Oh. Oh, one little girl, I'm a dancer and uh, I, I learned Chinese opera. Yeah, but more than ten years I never do it. Never do the I just yeah, I think that yeah, make money the most important. <laughs> Why give some Chinese tradition dancing and opera is amazing. Oh, in that time I feel, oh my god, this is real me. This is real, this is real. I find myself, you know. And yeah, I should do this. Yeah, actually, I, I should do something about art. Yeah, in that time I think, oh, I'm a dancer, I'm a singer. Oh, I remember myself. What, what did I do in the past 10 years? Yeah, what I do, I just waste my life. You make, only make money is waste your life. You should do something you really interesting, you do it, you really passion. If you're not so really passion to your life, you just waste your life, I think so. Life is so short. And now I, I find the Chinese traditional culture, traditional thing, it's so beautiful than the popular music, than the popular dance. In the last ten years, in the last several years, I like the West music, I like I like hip hop music, pole dancing. I think this is why this is more popular, more nice. But now I think the traditional is the most beautiful, and it's so classical. Even the singer is be right one hundred years ago. When I sing Chinese opera, the West people they can't understand what I'm singing, but they sing so beautiful, they just feel so beautiful. So you like this and other Chinese tradition? If I have a chance, I will go to... I like to learn the Italian opera. Oh really? Mm. You know that the first opera I saw in my life was in Beijing? Oh my god, in Beijing what? Yes, in the Beijing, you know, the big theater, the one that seems a UFO. And um, it was uh, Turando, I don't know how to pronounce. It's uh, an opera wrote by Puccini. It's about uh, a man who wants to marry the daughter of the Emperor of China. Is Chinese actor or other countries actor? All Chinese. When I went to, they were all Chinese. Also, the um, 
the production was you very never good. Never saw uh, an opera show before in Italy? No, almost ten years ago. It was in 2011, and they all sing in Italian. And, Chinese are all and they Italian. were spe- oh all were singing about uh, China. Oh, China! It's very particular to be an Italian sitting in Beijing in the middle of Chinese people looking Chinese people making an Italian opera about China. This was a very great experience. <laughs> Why I want to go to Germany? And um, because I think the German guys serious. You know, they always serious to another person. They are serious to make car. They are serious to make machine. And so I think it's good choice if I have a German boyfriend in the future. <laughs> this is my choice. I'm not so prefer to American because for Chinese, you know, we, for example, if I have a bad Chinese by friend, if you think my parents is his parents, if you treat my parents like his parents, but if I have an American by friend, if you think, oh, your parents, your parents, it doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sorry. I'm not saying every American people. Yeah. Some people I think it's a good choice if you have a cooperation with the man terms. Mm. Yeah, because they they good eye to make money. They 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 will do everything so clearly. Yeah, you you maybe this is your this is your eye. Even we are get married, even you are my girlfriend. Yeah, which we are totally surprised. In emotional, they are not so strong connect with others with others. This is the most big difference with Chinese. So you think Chinese can be more connected between uh, uh, themselves? Yeah. The Chinese boyfriend, yeah, he, he would like to do everything for me. If my family came to Shanghai, I have a Chinese boyfriend. If I didn't tell him, he will say that you don't love me. Why you don't love me? Why you don't let me know? meet your family? You don't love me. Why you don't me? Let me offer your, your parents a dinner or lunch like this, you know. Because uh, I can say um, in Italy nowadays, uh, for many people too, you know, when you start to see a, a person, many people uh, usually they fear to meet uh, the family mm. because they are not sure the story will go on. So they don't want to connect too much because if the story finished, uh, they uh, fear they will suffer. If you really don't like your girlfriend's family, I think it's not a good choice you still stay with your girlfriend. It's not funny, it's not joking. It must be. Yeah, even I'm so different with my family, but it must be have something similar. So I can't from my family. But if you cannot accept them, totally cannot accept them, yeah, someday we must be broke up if you really don't like them. If you would like to say something to your past self, what would you like to say? And if you would like to say something to your future self, mm-hmm. what would you like to say? It's easy if I talk to my past life. I just don't want to say goodbye. I think it's different. Every day is different. I'm so different. Today is so different with past of me. Now, when I think about my life one week ago, two months ago, one year ago, I think, oh, it's so stupid. I think myself so stupid. If time come back, you know, I won't do like this. Yeah, I will be better. So this is why I always want to say goodbye to my past of my life. But I know finally I will keep something all the time, all the time, all my life. I will keep something all my life. But in my life, actually, I, I want to far away from my past of my life. And what would you say to your future self? My future, my life, yeah. I hope I can become more freedom, totally freedom on my soul. 
I hope I can become really just like I live in the heaven. Yeah, I'm only looking for guru, I'm only looking for God. I just myself school, I just myself school, myself God. Yeah, I can find my nature, what I'm doing, just what I want. This is a perfect me. <laughs> I hope tomorrow I will achieve this day. I'm sure you will. If my soul totally free now, yeah. I will live in heaven every moment. I think many people too until they all they die, they never find their nature, never find what is their really passion and they never live a totally freedom life. Always have many rules. Always have something out of them. Yeah, maybe what they think about is not what they talking about. I see. Thank you very much for your interview. And thank you. Thank you for uh, believing in this experiment. Thank you very much for interviewing me and let me talking about so much talking about what I want. See you in the next episode of uh, Strange Tales of Hawaii. <laughs> I don't know how it is. <laughs> <laughs>